Oh, it's just so funny. It's May 23rd, 2022. It's my birthday. A year ago, I ordered a plushie from a really wonderful bubbly content creator. And uh, for the last two, for the last week or so, my mother has been on vacation to Florida. And we had a little bit of an issue with package theft in my area. So I've been worried about not getting what it was that I've been waiting for that was finally shipped. I just went outside to go look at the gas in my car to go be able to go by my mom's house to look for this package as well as to water her plants. And a van pulls up, guy walks out, hands this to me, and I'm like, oh, cool, it's something for my uncle or my dad. I look at it, and it has my name in Finland on it. And I am so happy. Um, I, uh, I've been dealing with mental health concerns for years. And uh, running into the character that this person created and how passively soft they are with some of their content creation, the stuff that they do was just so wonderful. And um, uh, the title for the van became due and I got a hold of some credit cards and some miscommunications happened and uh, everything kind of blew up. My van ended up having issues. And it blew a rod, and like the last three days of this plushie being for sale, with like only two left, I just said fuck it, and I bought one. Because uh, life was being a grump, and I was irritated, and I just wanted something huge. Oh my god, it's huge! I had no idea she was just big. Lumipede! Oh my god, it's literally Lumipede. It's a vacuum suction cup Lumipede. <laughs> <laughs> Just the cuteness of this. Oh my goodness. It's huge. What? Look at how cute he is. Oh. So what? Are these finished? Treats and sacks. Oh my gosh, you are so wonderful, Lumi, for including all these wonderful, cute things. Then again, I did pay for a bunch of these. Oh my gosh. They're so wonderful. It's funny to realize some of the packing information might have just been kind of weird. Or something or other, because I didn't order this. I didn't ask for the patch. But oh my god, this is go. I don't even know where to put this. It's so beautiful. It she it has a reflection in the light. And the stitching is different for her hair. That's so cool. Oh my goodness. They just threw in a bunch of goodies from a bunch of other stuff. That's so wonderful. I absolutely adore you if you ever get to see this unboxing video. Thank you for the kindness and all the wonderfulness that you made with this character. Is this a pin stand? Is there... Maybe it's a traveling case? Oh, that's a pull tab, okay. <laughs> Look at these prints. Oh, these are amazing art pieces too. It's so cute. I absolutely adore this finished content creator and all that she has made. This is supposed to be a letter addressed to me. Wait, where's the knife? I don't want to ruin this adorably cute envelope. I'm corny as shit and I like really cute, soft, plushy things. I think what's really adorable is the fact that like the clothing and everything is independently packaged. I have some V Shoujo pins and a couple of other stuff that is going to end up on her little pocket back pouch because 
why not put VTuber stuff with the VTuber plushie? Oh, that might not work properly. I'm trying to be gentle with this envelope because it's so cute. Yay, it's a polymer adhesive. Oh, yay. This is the adhesive Finland uses. They're a lot better than the United States, I'll tell you that. It's just peeling perfectly. Yay. I'm such a corny little shit. I am so stoked with all these wonderful things. Thank you, Lumi, you wonderful human, and her wonderful team for running into my email mentioning that my family members were off on vacation and I asked about having a last minute mailing address change. God, it's so cute. That's her business card. I just realized visually it's gonna be backwards, not readable, but that's okay. It says Lumi Tuber, professional wolf girl. Wolf girl. <laughs> it's just so cute. Plushimi, that's so cute. So cute. It's number 30? I know I was not order number 30, but this is so cool to get. That's so sweet. I believe I was order 154 or something. No, wait, there's only 150 of these. Uh, I was order 46. Yeah, that sounds about right. Oh, woo. While dealing with my mental health issues, I recreated aspects of my inner child. And part of his character design was inspired by Inuyasha. And part of my mind, oh my goodness, these are cute. Part of my mind just absolutely adores Lumi's ears and parts of what she's created and aspects of the character. Oh no, it's stuck to the business card. Okay, put the put those away for now, little one. But yeah, so I uh, I bought this not for myself, but for my inner defense mechanism that fell in love with this character. Because while rebuilding my inner child, I ended up having inspirations from Shippo and other aspects of Inu Yasha. I love you, Lumi. I love Lumi's team and everyone that participated in all of this. Look at how cute these all are. These different characters, they're just so wonderful. It's Siv! Wait, so is this Meriwether? I don't recognize this lovely character. It's really cute, and this is totally going... Oh, it's a clasp keychain! It's totally going to go random places in my room. Because that's what I've been doing with random lovely things in my room for the last few months. This is so wonderful. This is such a beautiful, beautiful arrival for my birthday. I still have to go to my mom's house and water the garden, but I'm so happy. I don't have to worry about these things getting to me or not. Look at how precious that is. They're all so wonderful. And the finished treats are pretty cool too. Mm. 
Moomin Milk Chop. Oh my gosh, the character is so cute. That's the one thing that I really love about other nations that the United States doesn't do, is we don't embrace characters all that well for some of our products. Natural colors and bacon. I have an obsessive love for Swedish fish. Something tells me I'm going to enjoy these Moomin fruit candies. All right. <sighs> 10 minutes into this unboxing video. The Louie Peed. <laughs> I just want to get a bunch of extra fabric just to be able to sew a tube with a bunch of little feet on it so it could be Louie Peed. Is <laughs> everything un... Vacuum seals. Oh my gosh, she's so big. Mm. Flop. That's too cute. So big. Oh, that's how they did the hair. Oh, look how they sewed this. Oh. She is so beautifully made. This is just too cute. The process pictures of just the face, because this face is one single panel, and just 40 or 50 of these faces in a plastic tub was really, really cute and really, really funny as they're just like, mid progress. This plushie is so much bigger than I thought it'd be. Holy crap. She's almost as big as my stuffed unicorn. <sighs> okay, I guess I'm putting Lumi on a unicorn. Look at how cute this is. Look at how wonderfully made this little bag is. There's more stickers and cute little goodies inside. There's Mary. There's Mary. <laughs> These are all so cute. I'm so happy this arrived on my birthday of all things. I am so thankful for Lumi's team for being able to change my shipping address last minute. If you ever get to see this video, you, you have my appreciation in a style I will never be capable of saying. On a whole nother note though, this is easily one of my favorite emotes and other things that has ever happened on the Lumi stream. This is actually something that has popped up on her stream before that she posed as and it was really cute. Dragged along for the fun I see, good sir. That's the happiness. And then uh, my V Shoujo pins are probably going on to this little pouch. So much cuteness. So much wonderful cuteness. You have done so well on all of this little pieces of this lovely little printer. Oh, oh no. The booties! Oh my gosh, these are just so cute. It's a full-on skirt. This is this is a real full-on skirt. Fully plated and everything. Look at look at the layering. Look how well the layering is done in this cute little thing. <sighs> There's no velcro snap on this one. It's just we just wedge this one on and we stick the velcro strap on the other side. But where does the tail go? <laughs> There's no tail hole. Oh, woo. This is so cute and corny. They're really smart to package everything independently for shipping, though.
that over there, this over here. Casual jacket, a woo. Oh no, the arm doesn't fit through the plush. Oh no, the arm doesn't. <laughs> the arm's a little big for the shirt. That's okay. That's to the joints. That's what matters. Such a huge plush. She has to be hand washed and knowing everything. It's just going to be ridiculously pampered and kept away from all the dirt. So that's the Velcro seal. That's that. That's that. So corny and cute. Stubborn plushy hand. Let's do that. Oh, I am adult. These are socks. <laughs> I'm like, I don't remember what goes what and where. And it's like, no, these are socks. These are not gloves. Legs. Two different thicknesses. The legs are two different thicknesses, and the sock is just a hairline smaller. Wrestling on plushy clothes. Do -ba do 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 do. <laughs> this is just too cute. This is too big. Such a wonderfully big plush. It will fit perfectly in a moment. You'll see. Thank you for hanging around with me being an airhead for 17 minutes. I just have a love for this character. Because we were all cute, comfy, a woo humans. We're precious human being, beings. Such a cute statement. Because we're all really, really weird. When it gets down to it as a whole, we as humans are freaking weird. Fleshy sock is not going on properly. <laughs> I'm having an existential crisis. The foot with the sock barely fits into the shoe. <laughs> the foot with the sock barely fits into the shoe. I love the fact that you can tell they use the exact same measurement on the foot, the sock, and the shoe, and thus they're all the same size. They're not scaled, and so that's why this is so amusing to me, is because it's just, stuff the cotton in the hole. Stuff the cotton in it. Can you get the cotton? Just just crush it down as much as you can like you're vacuum packing it, and just ram it into the shoe. I am so 
happy right now. I am so happy right now that the email actually made it to Lumi's team and they just didn't reply while changing my shipping address. So I don't have to worry about this little one getting lost by porch thieves or anything like that. Because it's fucking huge. Holy shit, look how big she is. It's so cute. That's how that sounds okay, like that then. It's just that's smart. A little bit of elastic and then you pull this thing down like this. I have my movie. As a bunch of stuff falls over, but this is where she's going. Casual on top of my unicorn. On a whole nother note though, my grandma asked me to show her the giant things I've gotten in the mail. Hey grandma. Grandma? Yeah. Oh! They're in your room. Are you tidy and adorable? Yeah, you wanted me to show you the cute little plushie that I ended up getting for my birthday. Yeah, I'd like to see it. Oh, wow, that's cute. Isn't she big, too? Oh, that's really... Isn't she cute? Here. Yeah. They were a big kiss. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's gorgeous. Isn't she? Oh. Like, I'm really impressed with how well she was made. And so that is a handmade plushie. Oh, but it's so cute. It you really is. Cheeks. Yes. Somebody sewed her by hand with a sewing machine. That's why she's so big and so wonderful. Oh, yeah. That's it. And her clothes are gorgeous. Aren't they just cute? Look at her shoes, even. Yes. Yeah. And the weight of her. Yeah, I, I mean, like, yeah, that's a ridiculously big plushie. I didn't expect it to be that big. Okay. As, as they handed me the box, I'm, like, holding the box. So I'm like, there's no way this is a plushie. And I'm like, wait a minute, this is a plushie. Oh, yes. That, uh, you know, her clothes... You know, like even her, you know, her, her neck. Yeah, they did. And, and, they did a wonderful job, and the bag is an independent bag too. And our purse. Yes. Yeah, that it's a very original. Yes, it is. Don't you? Think yes, her so? character is a very original character. And the weight of her, my goodness! Oh, look at all her skirt. Oh, I she, love you. She's gorgeous. Yeah. yeah, you'll be delighted to show that to your mother, though. Yes, my, yeah. my mom will find that very adorable because she's aware that I've been waiting for it for the last year. Oh, for it to come. Yes. Yeah. Oh, I compliment you, too. You know, like her, you see, like a little friend, yes. even. Yeah, I'm really impressed with how well Lumi's team did with making her. Oh, it's very unusual, though. 
you know, like on our clothes even. Yeah, because uh, nothing's yeah. actually sewn to the plush. All of that's removable. Oh, yeah. Yes. It's, the it's really, really well and it's really smartly designed. Uh, yes, and uh, you know that uh, she's so realistic as well. You know that uh, there's nothing cheap about her. There's nothing, yeah, I know. That's one of the things I'm really, really just and love. And how come that you picked this fellow, or this girl? So uh, she is a VTuber, and so this is an avatar that a person uses to be able to broadcast games, sports, and a bunch of other stuff. And oh. so she's somebody who's uh, really positive with what she creates, and the character as a whole is just really, really well reflective of my obsession with wolf, human, animoid, humanoid. Like, Delisa got me an Inuyasha shirt yesterday for my birthday, that shirt that was black that I held up. Yeah. Yeah. And so I have, um, well, from when I was little, I kind of have like a dog boy love from the character Inuyasha, from me being a little kid watching that all the time. So she's a dog girl of a character. And she's from Finland. She talks about sweets and bubbly things. She has an obsession with uh, Coca-Cola. Oh, no, sorry, Diet Pe Pepsi Max. And, oh. and it's just really, really cute. The character and the dynamic made me smile. And there's just things that I've been working on with my mental health. And when she announced this plushie, I kind of freaked out both in my head and in my defense mechanism. And so I decided oh, to get her last so minute. A bunch of stuff went wrong during the month that she was for sale. And at the end of her sale period, I just kind of went, you know what? I'm just going to get it because it'll make me smile. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that, uh, she's ideal. Yeah, she's know? cute. And, and even her little equipment you yes. know, that she has. Your mother's going to be delighted with her. You know. Yes, just... my mother will find her absolutely adorable. Because my mother loves my stuffed animal obsession. Oh, does she? Yes. Oh, well, that's good. I mean, because you have other things. Yes. That'll do it, though. But uh, she's a beauty, though. You know, that, that uh, yes. it, it's all so. I absolutely adore her. Yes. Yeah. And the nice thing about it is that she's so nice and clean and, you know, won't be all messy. Or yes, I'm going to stick her off in the corner and she's going to be a lovely little thing to enjoy. And even her feet are padded. Yes, yeah, that's what's really, really cute too is the fact that all of her feet and her hands are also reinforced. If you, oh. feel, if you feel her hands, you can feel the padding is reinforced in her oh, hands yeah, as well. quite well packed. Yeah. Yeah, but I'm really she, proud of everything Lumi made with this. Oh yeah, so it's well worth getting it. Yes. Okay, I'm gonna go stick yeah. her on her unicorn now. Yeah. Are you ready for lunch soon? Well, you know, as soon as you're ready. You okay. But uh, she's just adorable. Isn't though. she? Yes, I absolutely love it. I'll I'll pull her up on on the TV in the living room, and I'll show you a video of her actually performing as herself later on. Oh, yes, really? yeah, I will show you LumiTuber as LumiTuber. This is this is Plushimi. This is Plushimi. <laughs> Plushy Lumi. But you have other stuff too in your room. Yes. Right? She, she is going on top of my unicorn. Oh, do you? Unicorn? Yeah, she's going on top of my unicorn. Oh, I, I see. Yes, yes. that's it. It kind of adds to what you got. Yes. You know? she, she will beautifully add to the aesthetic of my room and what I'm making as a streaming space while at the same time making me smile day to day. Oh, good. Because Plushimi. <laughs> yes, you're very lucky. You got I am very lucky that I got this little one. You know, it's been so long ago. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. You know, you I'm... really forget about it. <laughs> I'm going to go stick her away and on her unicorn. Yeah, what's up? Okay. I, was, I, I was just asking you, when your toes is ever dry, you know? Yeah. Is, is there any reason, is there any... The coughing. It could actually be from your cough over the last week. Oh, is that Yeah, right? that's probably what it is. Oh, we'll get some cough drops and stuff for you here in a minute. Because my Legend of Zelda butt bu belt buckle came undone, and that's all chinging around. Put that there.
I adore that that was my grandmother's reaction. Oh my gosh, I did not expect that at a whole. <sighs> this is a 30 minute unboxing video and I'm totally not editing this at all. I am massively proud of Lumi's team and how well they made this plush. And like the instructions are like, remember to shake it a bit because it's a little unplushed for shipping. And it's like, no, this is perfectly plushed. This is perfectly stuffed and perfectly made. I love the quality of this. And everything is wonderfully reinforced. And so massive shout out to the uh, lovely lady part of Lumi's team who sat over her sewing machine and streamed a few times while making these. Thank you. You were wonderful for making these wonderful little ones. All right, I'm going to go obsess over LumiTuber stickers and pins and stick my V Shoujo pins here. These ones. These ones. They're going to go right here in the pouch. Because I have my massive... Iron Mouse t-shirt over here because of my Mikey Tungsten Mao. Now I have a plush Lumi. This makes me so stupidly happy.